Hello guys, I spent last 90 minutes uh, fishing um, in the channels, in the channel. So uh, if you come to South Padre Island, that's another great option to fish. If you can see here, there's a lot of decks and boats, <clears throat> the same this way. Usually those channels are pretty dead, <clears throat> excuse me, at the bottom. There is no, um, uh, no um, vegetation, no plants no old trees no old branches uh, whatever you find in the lakes on different part of the um, or like um, uh, grass beds nothing like that exists at the bottom of these channels so <clears throat> that influence what kind of fish live here if you want to come here and fish and this is pretty great experience easily accessible you can get on the deck uh, in your uh, sport shoes you need your like uh, gearbox your rod and reel and that's it it's very convenient at the same time few things matters first of all uh, the bottom is that so uh, it's great to bring shrimp it's great to bring a mullet or your um, um, artificial lures the one i showed you in the video as uh, the are i show in this video are the ones that always work for me not every day but always work for me when I come to South Padre Island. So if you would like to buy the same stuff, it will be a good investment. Usually, I, oh, I, I'm sorry, I always like to say there is not always a fishing day with fish. So uh, I like those gears, I like them, they bring me fish, but not every time, not every day. And But also, the beautiful thing about this channel is a lot of black drums and uh, red drums come here to eat this and let me show you now what they eat that's a lot of shell oysters i guess i don't know professionally how they called those oysters live under those kind of decks so when you come here and you want to fish the channel look for the old decks that would be a great advice to consider from me and look uh, uh, beneath them and see those fish come here from the ocean, from the Gulf of Mexico, to eat this. So when you come here, it's great to start fishing just all, all over the old decks that are around. So wrapping it up a little bit. Channels are great at South Padre Island. Usually there is nothing at the bottom. And uh, usually the great place to fish is a deck, underneath the deck when the oysters are. I caught in this channel a black drum, red drum, uh, ribbon fish and flounder the last two ribbon fish and flounder they obviously are looking for the other smaller fish to eat how you can decide if there is a smaller fish and then you want to chase a uh, uh, ribbon fish and the flounder you uh, the great thing is to watch birds if there are birds hunting here looking for a fish uh, you can see black herons or night herons standing on their dogs or those uh, decks, I'm sorry, and they're looking for a, a smaller fish. That might be a good indicator that there is also a flounder and ribbon fish in this channel. Guys, have a great time at South Padre Island. Take care. Bye-bye.